When I was 21 What's up guys, welcome back to another MLB The Show 17 Diamond Dynasty event video. In the last video, we got a victory and we ended up going 6-0. We got a JD Martinez as our 6th game reward. So that was the last time you saw this in a video. Now, I did decide to play with that team on stream, like I think maybe like 3 or 4 nights ago. And I ended up going 1-2 and two on stream. So the run ended at 7-2. and two. So unfortunately, we have to jump into it again with a new uh, run. So I'm going to show you the changes I'm going to make to this team for this run through. I think with pitching, I'm just going to stay with what I have. I don't see anything really wrong with my pitching because it is all just like, you know, uh, silver players. But let's talk about the guys I'm going to change in the uh, starting nine. So I'm taking out Ted Williams and I'm going to put in Charlie Blackman, the 94 Charlie Blackman. Also, we're going to be starting Joe Maurer at catcher instead of Jorge Posada. And for shortstop, I'm actually going to put 99 Cal Ripken on the bench, and I'm going to be using Jimmy Rollins for my starting shortstop to get another switch hitter in there. I'd like to get, you know, kind of the, the match matchup sort of thing. So those are the main three differences I'm making. Uh, with Charlie Blackman, I have him playing first. I don't know how good that's going to be. We might have to make a switch where we put, uh, like, uh, Edgar at first base or something like that, but that would kind of mess up the lefty-righty balance. We'll just have to wait and see. We'll give him a shot and see how it goes. But, yeah, guys, going into the new event. So yes, zero wins, zero losses, but we do have 23 total wins, so we are two wins away from getting that 25 total win reward, which I believe is just another gold player, which is cool. So uh, two more wins for that, but we're just going for our first one of the run today, trying to get back on track, trying to get back in the swing of things. So let's get it, guys. Event game number, I don't know how many, but we're going for win number 24 and win number one on this run. Okay, boys, let's go. First game, we are taking on the, don't even know how to say that city, but the Watermen. He's got Lou Brock, Urgh, Alex Gordon, V-Mart, Sean Green, the 92. Haven't seen that card in a minute. Buddy Bell, Robinson Cano, Yachty, 85, Jorge Polanco. We're facing Samarja. And so I'm not going to be the home team, so I'm not going to have a shout out for a comment. So once again, drop a comment down below. Let me know what ballpark you want to see me play at in the next video. And I'll choose a comment. As long as I'm the home team, I'll play at that ballpark. All right, here we go. Carlos Beltran starting off. We're playing in Coors Field. So expect some dingers here today, boys. Balls are going to be flying out of the yard. Oh, he called that a strike. That's a great pitch. That's a great pitch on two strikes. 3-0 count to Jackie Robinson. Let's see what he does right here. I'm going to take, but I'm just going to try and see. Yeah, he's going to go outside on the outside part of the plate. Uh, all right, 3-1 count. If it's not a fastball in our sweet spot, don't swing. Yep, there you go. Oh, that's a very questionable call right there, Blue. Come on now. I guess it makes up for an earlier one. But all right, 3-2. And Jackie just... Oh, that ball was... At, of course, I got good timing on it too. Got good timing with perfect PCI placement. And it went foul. Luckily, we still got on base. Thank you, Kame. Come on now. Yep, there we go. We got a good jump right there. Get in there with the hook slide. And we're safe. Let's go. And then Griffey. Deep. Go, Jackie. That's not going to be caught. Go, Jackie. Go, Jackie. Go, Jackie. Let's go, man. Griffey's going to get a triple out of this. And that is going to be our first run of the game. Ken Griffey Jr. coming up with the slugging percentage and an RBI. There's only one out. Which is nice, and it doesn't matter. That mo that ball might leave the yard. Andre Dawson, oh, it was off the top of the wall, and it's taking a crazy bounce out there in center field. There's a chance we could get in inside the park or out of this, and we're why would you not throw it, bro? You just can't not throw the ball right there. You just literally gave me another run. It is now three to zero inside the parker for Andre Dawson, and then Charlie Blackman in his home ballpark. You Oh my god, my dude. My dude. Don't throw me fastballs down the middle. If it's all going to leave, it's Coors Field. Even Joe Ma Oh, if that ball leaves. Okay, that's a cheese home run. I'm sorry to my opponent. That should not leave the yard ever. Look, yeah. No, 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 no. Don't give me a home run on that game. Come on now. That's not right. Ooh, I think we were a little underneath that. Yeah, that's going to stay in the yard, even though that is still carrying right in front of the warning track. All right, guys, we had eight batters up, five runs came across the plate. Good start to a game, if you ask me. Uh-oh, Lou Brock's getting on base. That's not good, boys. Oh, that's always a bad sign. Yep, he's easily going to get second out of that. Still, you got to at least try to throw him out. 
Ooh, we get, got a pop-up from Alex Gordon, though. Will he try to run on Dawson right here? Uh-oh, Dawson didn't get behind it. I don't know why, man. I was, I thought I was in the little... I don't know. Okay, whatever, whatever. Ah, uh, he, he kept that ball fair. Oh, wow, dude. If my Jackie Robinson, like, home run swing can't kept, be kept fair, how does he keep that fair? <sighs> okay. All right, we're going to Justin Wilson in the bottom of the second inning. He's got Cano up first, so we're going to play the lefty matchup. He does have 99 Yachty up next, which is kind of sketch. And he still gets a hit. Dude, I don't understand this. This is this is wild right now. I have a 5-1 lead, and I seriously don't feel comfortable whatsoever with this guy. This guy seems to really be timing everything. Or he's just sitting dead red, honestly. Even when there's a fastball outside, he's early. So I got to try and mix up a lot of off speed with... What in the world was that? Did the <laughs> the stick just didn't go up? There we go. Come on, Dawson, get behind this thing. Actually, get behind it this time. <sighs> Dude, why won't it ever let me get like the right position on the ball, man? What the hell? Get him with the high cheddar right here. All you want to do is swing at fastballs. I'll give you fastballs. They just ain't gonna be in the zone. This guy literally can't swing if it's not a fastball. Or he can't hit if it's not a fastball, I should say. Yeah, look at him. Look at him. He's literally just swinging at everything. Let's go with the high cheese again. We'll, we'll literally go back to the same exact pitch. Oh, uh, he actually took there. There you go. Okay, you know what? I'm not even mad about that. The fact that he was actually able to adjust and take the curveball the other way. I'm, I'm fine with him hitting a home run right there because that means that he straight up beat me. You know, it's not like the game kind of cheesed me out of something. He just straight up beat me right there. That was a good swing. Griffey, first pitch of this inning. That ball is going deep, and it's going to be another extra base hit for Ken Griffey Jr. He once again has trouble fielding it, and I believe that's the second time that Ken Griffey Jr. has gotten to third base on his swing. Oh, my God, Griffey's killing it today. And that will definitely be enough to get him home as it sneaks through when Dawson finally comes up with a hit, gets an RBI. Let's go, man. We got one of those runs back. <sighs> of course, it backed him off. I have a feeling he would have swung at that. I kind of had a feeling he would have he, he would have swung at that pitch. Get him with a slider right here. Come on, man. Joe Mauer, block ball. Oh, this is getting really frustrating, man. It's like, ah, I have a five-run lead. And then it gets cut down to three, and then stuff like that happens. And then he's able to pull a fastball on the outside part of the plate and get a hit. And he's going to get to second because I decided to throw home. It's like, oh, my God, dude. This is just so frustrating right now. I don't know what to pitch to this guy. Like, it's a fastball almost off the plate. He gets an early swing, and he still pulls it. Like, it's cr I don't – the thing about this guy that I'm playing is that he's sitting dead red. He's only sitting dead red. The only thing he likes to swing at is fastballs. If he doesn't get a fastball, he probably doesn't swing, but when he has to swing and defend, he still gets good timing on the breaking pitches. And that, see, he didn't swing because it's not a fastball. Pitch off the plate. He's able to keep it fair. But Jackie Robinson is in the first inning. Can't keep, can't keep it fair. It's got to go foul, huh? I need 18 to come out pronto, boys. Oh, please don't get out. Please don't get out. Please don't get out. He's going to tie the game, though. Kelvin Herrera, my pinch hitter, or my, my bullpen pitcher, I should say, able to put one to right field and get a hit. At a baby. I want to keep him in because he has a changeup, and I think he's going to struggle with that. Beltron, yeah. Throw me another slide step curveball over the plate. Why would you slide step with four speed? Good hit, Beltron. Thank you. Come on, stay fair, baby. Stay fair, baby. Don't go foul. Thank you. We had the help of the game right there. Oh, my God. I don't know how that just did that. These ball physics are out of control. All right, now that I have a changeup with Kelvin Herrera, I should probably should have went to him a lot earlier. This might make it a little bit better. There we go. Yep, see? The changeup got him kind of fooled. I threw him the fastball, and this time he got jammed on it. He was waiting back thinking I was going to throw the slower pitch. There we go. All right, let's see if we can get him with the high fastball right here. High cheese. There we go. Boom. He wants it so bad. Changeup got him again. Really good. Kelvin Herrera might be the move for the rest of this game. Oh, my God. Joe Maurer. 
How do you leave a hanging breaking ball? That's an upper decker. Let's go, Joe. Ten runs now in this game. We are back with a hefty lead. <laughs> oh, I got him fooled so bad. I'm even striking him out on fastballs looking now. Oh, jeez. Woo, got him jammed on the inside fastball. I got him thinking about way too many pitches now. I think this was honestly like the fix. Is introduce the change up. And I think we'll be okay, boys. Here we go. Fastball. We got Yachty to fly out to center field. One down. Oh, my God. You thought I was going change up, didn't you? Nope. I went to the cheese just like you wanted me to. Slider. He's swinging out of his shoes. Low change up. Can it be the key? And it is. Yes. Kelvin Herrera won this game for me. I don't care about a single thing the offense did. Kelvin Herrera was the reason I won this game. 10-7 victory. Griffey had a great game with two triples, a home run. Dawson had a bomb with three RBIs. Maurer had that crazy. He had two home runs, actually. Beltran had a home run. We were good at the plate, but overall, once we started throwing the change up to this guy, all I needed to do was just actually get some off speed in there. It really made all the difference. After the third inning, this guy couldn't hit. All right, guys, so we did take the win. We are 1-0. 11 more wins to go. 24 total event wins. Next win, we go for our 25th total win, which will give us a gold card. So that should be pretty fun. So tune in for that. Remember, drop a comment. Let me know what ballpark you want me to see me play at. You might get shouted out in the next video. But thanks for watching, guys. Drop a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Make sure to subscribe if you're new, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.